hi and welcome back to another video in this channel uh my name is Martha makwata and uh, i'm bringing to you a video of me making they call it peanut sauce <laughs> in my mom's language it's called magira you can also refer to it as ginat sauce so let's get right into it as you can check right here this is our peanut that is already fried and uh, i just want to go ahead and grind it i looked for work and work brought itself these ones here got poured so i want to collect it and clear the counter then go forward to blend or to grind I'll be using this uh, machine here that is not so clean to grind. So I want to prepare everything, then we get to work. I'm starting off the process and uh, what I'll need is of course uh, the peanuts which are here. I hope you're able to see clearly. Hopefully. No. So I'm starting off and I'll be grinding here i've tried to wipe but you know it has some corners that we cannot really reach so i'll grind it and then at some point i'll add in some oil just about maybe a tablespoon to help it to grind well so let me start off i'll show you when i'm I'm done but let's see this together so that's how beautiful my grinder is I've never known that this one is this efficient you've seen just within a few seconds we have that so I'll continue and I'll show you So when that struggle starts, I'm now adding in some oil. This is what we have and uh, I want to add in some oil. So let us add together just a little bit about a tablespoon. Oops, sorry, I poured outside. Huh? Uh, I guess that is about a tablespoon. Let's now, uh, let us now uh, grind it together. When we are working in the kitchen, messes happen, and especially now that I'm holding you using one hand. My phone is normally very efficient. Today I'm using an iPad, which is a bit large. That's why I'm quite clumsy. So let's do it. I'll show you the end, the, the consistency that we'll have at the end. This is the amount of peanut that uh, we've gotten from uh, our grinding. Yeah, it is in this bowl. I've just finished, I've not even done the clearance. This is the blender um, container that I've been using. And I'm using hot water to just uh, make a consistency that now I'll take to the fire. So I've rinsed out the peanut, the, the sauce that was remaining in this container. And that is what I want to use to mix in this bowl this one here so that we are able to now take it to the pan and prepare ginat for my family yeah so i'm mixing in some water into our sauce before i take it to the fire 
and as you can see it is quite thick this is supposed to feed uh, we are how many four five of us and uh, hopefully it will be enough so we are eating it with matoke so let me mix slowly by slowly the water is warm warm water so we'll mix until we get the right consistency then we move to the fire for now we mix in the water if this is not enough I'll just add so to get the right consistency so some of the sauce is stuck inside let me add in some water but we need not add the whole amount of water once so I'll keep adding as I go as I gauge the consistency of the peanut, ginat or magira however you want to refer to it is okay so we'll keep doing this so as you can see this is the consistency I've been looking for and I've discovered that as I did my grinding some peanuts did not uh, really grind but that is not a problem uh, the beauty is that everybody knows this is peanut sauce so let me get into the cooking in just a short while so we are adding our ginat to this pan and uh, I'll keep stirring this just behaves like porridge if we don't stir it gets stuck in the pan so i have to keep stirring and uh, my mala is ready let me reduce the fire a bit so this is the mala that I'm adding in um, yeah bio so that I'm able to take I hope it will not react with me so we'll keep stirring to avoid it getting lumps apart from the genets that remained inside we shouldn't form any more lumps inside So let us keep at it. I already put salt in the peanuts as we were frying. And I feel like I'll just add a little bit of salt, just a little. So we'll add in our mala. The other thing that we'll add in maybe is our, uh, a lemon to just make it more savory, savory. Yeah, to have that fermented taste. So let me add in our mala and I'll just add as I check added in about a cup of uh, our mala just about a cup or a glass so we keep stirring the next thing we'll add in is the lemon 
so our magira or if you like ginat sauce peanut sauce is undergoing on well so i want to add in this the juice of these two uh not two lemons one lemon it's evening i don't want it so 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 sour let me say so sour so that you are able to get what i'm saying or bitter so that it's good to our stomachs as we sleep so i've added in the juice of that one lemon and now we'll keep stirring until it's ready let let us come back once it is ready to be served so i'm um, adding in some salt not so much just this much i hope you are able to see well this much so we add it in and uh, generally our ginat or peanut soup is ready so we are serving it in a short while i don't want it so thick i want it runny so that we are able to have it well so let me show you how i'm going to eat it so this one is not the best server because it has the holes let me get a serving spoon so we are having it with the matoke which is right here so i want to put it in that uh, depression that i've formed yeah that's my ginat and i'm ready to enjoy it we have <laughs> here is my plate and i want to try it on our behalf i hope you've enjoyed uh, the ginat video and you're willing to try most people like eating it with the uh, sweet potatoes but we are having it with our sweet matoki so i hope you've enjoyed the video you've learned something and you're willing to try so until the next video the next time bye for now